Hello everyone, I am Kierden Jensen, aka Audio Dread, the uh, proud owner of Studio Dread LLC, and this is my first devlog for my new game that I'm working on, uh, currently called In Plain Sight. Everything about this is subject to change, but uh, this is just my first uh, devlog. All I have so far is this player model here, which uh, the, the art style that I'm going for with this game is just kind of... Um, my sort of prompt that I'm giving myself is uh, child sketched his nightmares slash uh, sleep paralysis demon. It's meant to look kind of somewhat childlike in terms of how it's drawn, but also kind of creepy. Uh, I don't want to give too much away about the plot of the horror game yet, just because it's very early in development still and a lot of it could change. But uh, essentially, this is going to be the art style is this grayscale charcoal sketch sort of look. Uh, so I just wanted to show off all I have so far is a player model. Uh, this is my first time making anything in Blender. So again, everything here is subject to change, but I wanted to go for a low poly sort of PS1 type style with it. Uh, I've got some animations here. Um, let's see. We've got a walk animation. Uh, you're always going to be holding a flashlight. That's going to be the main, um, main sort of mechanic is uh again not not to give too much away but this is going to be based off of light uh the the main threat or monster is basically only able to follow you or track you while you're in the shadows uh so the flashlight will be a major mechanic so i just kind of have them always positioned to be holding it we've got uh run here uh these are very basic and uh <laughs> pretty low quality uh, again first time using blender but i don't know i think there's kind of a charm to it uh he's also a little flat i might make him a little more thick that's just um to do with the the kind of smoothing built into blender uh i've got the just idle here just went for a simple sort of breathing thing uh and then he does also there will be crouching involved um, I'm not sure exactly what all of the mechanics are going to be in terms of hiding and things, uh, but my plan thus far for the general premise is there's something in your house. Uh, I'm kind of going for a somewhat Mandela catalog inspired sort of story where there's maybe something, uh, something either alien or paranormal in some way that has kind of invaded your home. Uh, it's maybe something that is known to exist at this point, but you're just kind of trying to get out. Uh, it can only track you while you're in the shadows. You'll have a flashlight that's on some sort of recharge system that you can use to kind of prevent it from moving. Like it won't be visible or like uh, tangible while it's in the light. Uh, there will be other light sources that you have to kind of manage to try to keep yourself not visible to it. Um, so I'm not sure. It's the the crouch walk is definitely the jankiest. This is going to be first person, so you won't be looking at your character a whole lot, but there will be mirrors and things like that. And then, of course, you can look at your feet. So I wanted to make it look somewhat presentable, but this is just for a demo anyway. And then I'll probably polish these up when I get to a main release. I just kind of want to get something out there so that people can kind of give their feedback on it. I can see if it's something I should move forward with. That's everything I have to showcase. I'm going to be working on some other models, getting kind of a, a house of some form together, the, you know, monster in some way together. Um, all in this art style. Definitely expect more devlogs and updates soon for this little dude. Yeah, and uh, as always, links in the description for my uh, Twitter and Instagram, as well as my website. Uh, website's really just for portfolio type stuff, but you can find my other games there as well, links to them. You know, Twitter and Instagram, same sort of content as is going to be on the channel. It's mostly just for shouting that stuff out, but there will be some other stuff that I just kind of toss in there, just little updates, pictures, things like that. Um, also in the description is a link to my Patreon if you would like to support this game. Uh, patrons will get exclusive access to uh, just some behind, some extra behind the scenes things other than what you're seeing here, as well as uh, early access to playable builds of the game. So the first build will be on my Patreon for Patreon supporters. Uh, this model here, or this texture here, will uh, in just a PNG format will also be posted to my Patreon if you're interested in checking that out. Uh, that's all I really have to show off at this time, but as the development progresses, there will be more things. Uh, 
more behind the scenes type of stuff. You'll, you know, some code samples that you can look at and then uh, definitely builds of the game as basically any development build that I make, I'll be putting on my Patreon as well so that any Patreon supporters can play it, give feedback, uh, get kind of the earliest opinions out there and all of that fun stuff. So that's all I have for you today. Expect more devlogs in the near future. And thank you all for watching.